Everybody wants to have devices that are cool, that look good, that are useful and that will last for a longer while. This is a nice multi-port docking station. It's made of aluminium, it's got rubber feet on both sides so it can be used on both sides like this or like this. Why is it good? Because not always your connector would be on this side. Sometimes you will have to connect something from this side and that's why this is so practical. All you need to do is just turn it around and you can connect your stuff to it without any issues. Well, we know it's made of aluminium and we see it's got a nice curvature here and it's got those rubber feet so it doesn't really move and we know that we can put it on both sides. This is the IBDK2601C. It is nice, it's got an integrated half meter Type-C cable, it's USB 3.0 Type-C, it's a nice connector, it can be connected like this, but also reversible on the other side. Let's look what do we have inside this. Here we have a little combo audio port. This port will let you in and out audio, like microphone and headset. What we additionally have are three USB 3.0 ports, Type-A, one micro SD and one SD card reader. Additionally, what we've got are two HDMI ports, 4K 60Hz, and one VGA port for full HD in 60Hz. Here is a little Type-C charge port with a USB Type-C charge port. You could charge your laptop if you wanted. So, let's connect some stuff to it. See how it works. It's really, really easy. It will take us just a few seconds. I will start with two USB sticks. It's the most practical always. I will put a little Bluetooth dongle. I find it also very useful all of the time. It's inside the micro card reader first and then the card reader. Look how nice it is. I will connect one external screen to it through the HDMI port. Let's say here. Remember I told you what for this curve is? It is in order to connect the notebook to the docking station and still save time and space. So I will put it like this. Maybe for this example I will put it like this. I will take the computer and I will put it on top. Look how nice it sits together. It is perfect together. What's still left to be done is take the cable, the Type-C cable, and connect it to the host computer. Yeah? So we will have everything working together just fine. I will connect it here. Okay, it's connected. Let's turn everything on. As you can see, the screen is functioning. I can drag stuff to it, I can work with it, it is extended, I could make it a mirror as well, it is no problem, everything is possible, your wish is the limit actually. Everything that's needed with one small little device that not only extend the port, but also help us cool the computer a bit with the aluminium and the angle and saves place. We don't need anything around our computer, don't need anything sticking from the sides, we just have it below the computer, which is actually the most ideal. I hope you liked this video. If you liked it, please press like. If you didn't like it, press this like. Let us know why. Write us. Tell us. We'll be happy to hear you. We'll be happy to answer you. Have a nice one. Bye, guys.